MCC for this day of recognition for all of us, and congratulations to everyone on their service endeavors. Um, I am very humbled by this honor, so it means a lot to me. Um, I would also like to take a moment to thank my family for instilling in me the values of service and laying a strong foundation for me early in my life. And I would like to kind of just speak about what service has provided me with and what I'm sure it has provided with all of you with as well. In life, it's true that we are what we accept. And all of us have had exceptional experiences because we have accepted the challenge to look at a situation from a different perspective. We are all telescopes. So everyone can break out your telescopes with me. Break out your telescopes. So the standard mode of a telescope comes in the narrow view, right? You're widening, you got that narrow view. Just kind of reflects our own view of our life, our daily routines, and in life it's easy to get stuck in that narrow perspective. Through service, we're able to kind of crank that knob on our telescope. So crank it up. Oh, and look at the picture, it's getting bigger. It's getting bigger. Okay? So once we have this broadened perspective through service, we're able to include others. We're, we're also able to kind of look at the whole solar system of people and their experiences. And we kind of so start to realize that people are just like the stars. They're all unique in their own way. And we're able to interact with those people by our broadening our perspective. And now we have an all-encompassing view. We're able to rotate from left to right. We have a 360 degree view of what's going on around us. And it broadens our own personal horizons. With this broad view, we're able to look at the needs of individuals, the community, the nation, and world views. We're able to set sight on a specific issue and choose an endeavor to pursue. But this perspective is nothing without action and without focus. Once we have this broad view, we see the issue, we need to focus back in, turn our knobs, dial in, back in on this issue at hand and how we're going to take action to help the issue. As we do this, this adds dimensions to our own personal character. These can be significant impacts, such as one day I dressed up as a fortune teller and went to the senior center, and that had the accent and all. I mean, I had a beauty mark, it was amazing. You should have been there. Um, we can range from significant impacts to collaboration, and collaboration leads to grand impact. I work with the Grand Kids Foundation, which is Curtis Granderson, the Detroit Tigers Foundation for Inner City Public Schools in Michigan. And I was able to coordinate on campus a 5K run and walk. And from that, it led into working specifically with him to help develop adopt a school in the state of Michigan, which I'm currently working on and establishing baseball programs for after school inner city children. And through putting our telescopes together and the power of collaboration, we're able to kind of get on one specific issue from all of these different perspectives at one time. And it's extremely valuable to always consider that. Through service, we have to remember to remain dialed in on the specific issues that we're facing, and we have to make sure that we're dialed in on our own perspectives as well as others, and that we keep focused on the issues that we're trying to target. And I'd like you all to remember that you have the ability to inspire because you have the courage to act. It's easier in life sometimes to say no. Why would you want to do that? Sometimes it's more of a challenge to say yes. And I commend all of you for stepping up to that challenge and saying yes. So I would just like to speak a little bit about Bay Cliff Health Camp because it's amazing. Um, I chose to grab my money towards them because it is an intensive therapy camp for children in the state of Michigan. I'm sure the northern folks know what that's about. And it is the most amazing experience. If you want the most amazing experience of your life, hands down, I guarantee it. I've worked there the past three summers, and you help children that have special needs and handicaps. You help them. I help a girl learn how to walk. I help the girls how to use a prosthetic limb. Not having any background knowledge at all. I was really freaked out, actually, going there. I was like, oh my god, what am I going to do? But it teaches you so much. You see the growth that they have and the perseverance of the human will. And it teaches you so much about yourself. So definitely if you're looking for the most amazing experience of your lifetime, see me afterwards and I'll get you the information because it is one of the best organizations I've ever worked with and it has really taught me about how much you can challenge yourself to accomplish your own goals. So thank you very much.